Ryan Peterborough on Saturday, how are you feeling heading into this one? Yeah, I mean, after a disappointing, disappointing display against uh, Barnsley, obviously on Tuesday night, I think the whole team and definitely myself looking to put things back on track and uh, what keep pushing on from the previous games, Sheffield and QPR. Yeah, as you as you mentioned, results haven't been going our way recently. What has been worked on in training over the last few days? Yeah, look, we've had a really good session today. Got all the, we've had we've debriefed the Barnsley game manager and all the players. We've all had a discussion about it. Really gone into good detail and um, really trying to focus on this uh, Peterborough game on Saturday and try and really get the three points. Well, this is your first interview in permanently how pleased are you to officially be a Hull City player yeah and no, obviously like, absolutely buzzing about that but obviously I'm here to do a job and I want to stop, obviously just keep working hard and keep pushing on and keep getting points on the board for Hull and keep scoring and assisting and um, I think that's, my, that, like, that's, what, that's why I've been signed here to keep doing my job and obviously keep working hard how keen were you to get the deal done um, yeah massive like when the, obviously the opportunity was spoke about, I've been, I've heard, obviously I spoke a few times uh, to the club and stuff like that about it all. And obviously when it got obviously across the line on deadline day, I was uh, yeah, over a moon. What have you enjoyed most about your time here so far? I think it's just everything about this club. I think obviously the fans are a massive asset to the club. Um, really, when obviously like even the Tuesday game, they come in numbers, what was really good to see. And obviously we need that as well on the way days, especially against Peterborough on Saturday. And I think obviously the Glads, it's a really good bunch of lads and sort of gelled in really easier. Yeah, speaking on the fans, how pleased have you been with how they've taken to you? Yeah, no, over the, yeah, like they've been class all the way through the season, not just with me, with the team and that. And obviously with the, the takeover, everything, there's been a lot of changes this season. And yeah, obviously... They've stuck by us and obviously, and they've come in their numbers. For yourself, how are you finding adapting to playing in different areas of the pitch this season? Because obviously you've played further upfield, you've played at wing back, think you've also played in, in the middle as well. So how have you found that challenge? Yeah, as I touched on before, I'm here to do a job and I want to play. I don't really mind where I play, I just want to play. And um, I'm, I'm happy to do a shift wherever the team needs me to do it. You've spoken on scoring. You've got four goals so far this season. How keen are you to add to your tally before the end of the season? Yeah, I mean, as a forward player, I want to get as many as I can and help the team out as much as I can and obviously get assists as well in, in, in vital games, important games. And, and in, the, in this league, every game's important. So I want, to, I want to contribute as much as possible. And last month as well, I think you were having your own goal of the month tournament with um, two nominations um, against Everton and Bournemouth how happy are you with, with those finishes yeah I mean yeah it's like, obviously I want to carry on doing that I want to get a few more of them I don't want it just to be them too I want to be that I want to be doing that every month so still uh, still got Peterborough this month so hopefully can uh, change that for this month get my name in the hat yeah, and speaking on the head coach as well, Shota, I have a lad to, with him being a former forward as well, what's he been like with you working with you on the training ground? Yeah, I think he's trying to implement his ideas into our team and it's obviously, it, like for me, I've never worked with an international manager before and I think it's obviously adapting and getting used to the way he wants us to play and I feel like we are, every, game by game, we are getting there. And just going back to the deal as well, how nice is it to have the security of this being your permanent spell after a few loan spells as well. Yeah, no, I really enjoyed like living up here as well. I think that was a big factor as well, moving up. Found found a couple of nice houses that I've like enjoyed living in, renting out and stuff like that. So it's been nice and yeah, just happy to get the deal done and obviously stay up here.